percentage of 1.2 per cent over the last eight years, according to the King's Fund. And bringing it up to 3.4 per cent brings it more back to the traditional uplifts that we've seen. And yet, in actual fact, with an ageing population, the pressure is even higher. So this will hopefully stop the slide of the NHS, but the NHS Confederation themselves say it is not possible to transform on this kind of money. And it's therefore important that these other projects are looked at separately and are funded separately. And as for where that money is going to come from, I don't know how the Prime Minister kept a straight face when she talked about the Brexit dividend. The Institute of Fiscal Studies says there won't be one. The Office of Budget Responsibility talks about a £15 billion drop in public service and finances. So I'd like to know where will it be funded? Is it all just borrowing and tax rises? I think the government should be honest about how they're going to fund it.